This is O'Day with VR Renegades. We are here live in San Francisco's Soma District, one of the neighborhoods affected by gentrification. Behind you is Essa Pizza, one of the businesses affected by gentrification. It's been in my family for 15 years. And on this dark and gloomy day, this neighborhood is facing dark and gloomy times. So let's go inside and meet the man who started this business 15 years ago. Hi, my name is Adnan Awadawa. Uh, I'm the owner of SF Pizza in San Francisco. It's a 12-7 mission between 8 and 9. I've been in this location in this pizzeria for the last 15 years. Sooner they're going to we'll lose this place. Uh -huh. uh, I want to touch on the, the subject of the community. Um, everything is changing all around San Francisco. What is your take on all this change? Okay, everything is changing so fast. Why did they build all these buildings 10 years ago or 15 years ago? Somebody came here and threw a lot of money on the city with the mayor that he's approving any big projects and he doesn't care about small businesses like me and a lot of people. He's just driving us out of the city. Okay, the minimum wage is going up, it's gonna be $15. The project is costing you more. The rent, you'll never find a place less than 10000 in the city if you want to do anything. So I mean, it's really just looking for big, big numbers. Young people cannot afford these things. It's not going to happen. For more than 30 years, my dad has built more than just pizza. He's established a community. It's here, it's just like a friendly neighborhood. Everybody knows you, and everybody knows your kids, everybody knows your wife. You build a, a community around you. You know, you have a small business, and that's how it is. It's, it's building a community, even if it's an art place, or a picture place, or a liquor store. You're, all, you're building a community around you. And that's how life goes. I and mean, a lot of people, I don't know, they have no money. Oh, Dan, come on, give us a break. I'll give you a break. They come and pay me. Then, you know, this doesn't happen in a lot of different, if you don't have that much relation with the neighbors and with, with everybody. Every day, the dough is freshly made. And all our pizzas are hand tossed. The whole idea is just. You have to have the best products. You cannot cut corners. You cannot be cheap on food. Okay. That's it. SF Pizza along with other small businesses in the area are being forced out, making room for the high demand of housing in San Francisco, mostly unaffordable. Now, uh... My lease is over and they with me in month to month until uh, they decide when they're going to put the building in. Mm -hmm. We're not getting big, not even one dollar from anybody. The minute they want us out, they're going to give us a notice, which is three months, to pick up our stuff and leave. And I built uh, a life here, I built a community around me in here, and uh, I'm like, I'm going to leave with nothing. Just pick up my equipment and maybe take a break or maybe go somewhere else, which is going to cost me a lot of money these days, so I think I'm just going to take a break. <laughs> Shut